Um, someone said, why did you get fired at Harringay Council? I was just taking the piss. I was literally taking the piss. You know, like people say, like, oh, council workers are piss takers. They don't do no work. I was the, the top man. Yeah, I won the award for that still. You know what I used to do, yeah? So, like, obviously, man used to drive from, obviously, Edmonton to Tottenham. I would pick up my van at, like, 9 in the morning, although I should start at 8. So I'd pick up my van at 9 in the morning, drive to the calf, sit there and eat for about an hour, hour and a half, get to, or maybe, yeah, maybe an hour, then get to my first job, well, get to my job at 10.30, do about an hour and a half's worth of work, go for lunch for two hours, come back, yeah, so come back at about two, do about an hour and a half's work, and then, yeah, pack up and leave. So literally, I was only doing like three hours work a day. Fucking about. Fucking about. And then, yeah, they, they eventually they fired me and stuff. But you know what? Yeah, that was one of the best things that happened. Um, basically, what I did was, when I was in the meeting, when they was about to fire me, I had my phone. So I was recording the whole thing, like for an hour. Yeah. So I left the phone, went out of the room with the trade union. Like your trade union is almost like your lawyer kind of thing. Left the phone recording, came back in, got fired. And then when I went home, I was listening to the recording. And the guy that fired me was a, was a black man, one older guy. He said, oh, he's so stupid. He's just messed up his life and that. Hell fucking no. How the fuck did I mess up my life when a, a few years later, I'm earning 10 grand a month from working? Hell fucking no. I did not mess up my life. But you see, these people who, these older people that are just locked in the system of just working their whole entire life, they think that if you get fired from a job, like the local council borough, you fucked up your life. Like I had a dumb family member who claims they're depressed and sits down and does not work. They had not worked for like 30 years and that tried to say to me, oh, why would you... Why would you want to? Because I said to him, now, see, I got fired from work, but initially um, I wanted to resign anyway. He's like, why would you want to leave that job in the first place? And that? It's a good job, job for life and that. Fam, how dare you tell me what to do in my life when you're a grown-ass 60-year-old man, I've seen you my whole entire life, sit down in the same chair, depressed because you got left by a white woman, yeah? Talk about, why, why would you, and you don't own your own property and you live in a fucking council house and that. How you? How dare you tell me what to do with my life? And you're broke, man. Get out of here.